the prestigious title and 20 million euros await the winner between Manchester City and also Inter Milan in the final of the Champions League and that will be going right there in Turkey, Istanbul at the Olympic Stadium who has the sitting capacity of 74,753 spectators will be on ground to witness all the live action that will be happening right there at tomorrow in uh, the Champions League uh, final. Uh, the desire to welcome you to yet another video while you show. Ensure you get to subscribe to my YouTube channel and also get to follow me and like my uh, social media platform. Uh, that's talking about you know Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, uh, Twitter, uh, all at a VJ while so that we can keep uh, the conversation going. Uh, the big question for uh, today is uh, which team will win the Champions League? Will it be Man City or will it be, will it be in Tamil Land? Go straight uh, to my various social media platform and uh, let's you know, get to feel your posts about which team you'll be written for uh, to win uh, the Champions League. Let's quickly look at the preview of uh, this year uh, Champions League. When you look at uh, both uh, Manchester City and also Inter Milan road to the final at this point in the semi-final uh, City were 5-1 you know, winners over uh, Real Madrid. They actually you know, defeated the defending champions uh, to seal their place in uh, their uh, Champions League a final where uh, the likes of uh, you know Inter Milan and also get uh, to beat you know uh, the rivals talking about uh, AC Milan 3-0 on aggregate uh, at uh, the San Siro for them uh, to see the passage uh, to uh, the finals. Uh, these uh, will be uh, the 13th season that uh, Inter Milan are yet uh, to win uh, the Champions League. When you look at the last time Inter Milan won at uh, the Champions League was uh, the 20 uh, 2009 to 2010 season and you can see that uh, it has been a long time uh, since Inter Milan has not won uh, the Champions League. Of course, Inter Milan they won uh, their first uh, Champions League in the uh, 1963-64 stroke uh, 64 season and also uh, they won it 10 years after 1964-1965 uh, stroke 1965, you know, uh, season. So it seems that uh, this might just have been working for them. Who knows? Uh, uh, let's get to uh, see Manchester City. This is, will be uh, the second time Manchester City uh, will be playing in the finals. Remember the last final was in 2021 uh, uh, where Kain Harvard talking about Chelsea uh, defeated Man Pep Guardiola side uh, by a long go. And uh, just to let you know that uh, of course Manchester City will be going for trouble talk at, uh, when you look at uh, how far they have been able you know, uh, to go this season. They have won the FA Cup they have won you know, the Premier League and they are looking forward uh, to win the trouble against Inter Milan so that they can actually you know, equal their local rivals record that is of winning uh, the treble talking about you know uh, Manchester United when they actually won the treble in the 1999 season and also Inter Milan has not actually done badly this season because uh, they have been able to win you know uh, the Coppa, the Super Coppa Italian, and also the Coppa Italian uh, this season after they actually you know, defeated you know Florentina uh, two one for them uh, to emerge uh, at champions. Uh, when Manchester City and Inter Milan has not played any competitive match, this will be the first competitive you know match they will be playing in. And the last two meeting it was uh, a preseason you know cup which uh, Inter Milan actually you know, won you know the first game in 2010 by three zero, and also a year later City actually you know, avenged. Uh, Within that same, you know, uh, particular score, winning Inter Milan 3-0 in Dublin uh, when they actually play a season, uh, a preseason, you know, tournament in that you know particular one. So it's going to be a cracker at this uh, point uh, in time. And when you look at, uh, you know, players to actually watch out for, of course, uh, you have to watch out for all the players in Manchester City and also all the players in uh, Inter Milan as well. But uh, some standard player uh, this season we cannot but mention. Talking about uh, the life likes of uh, Haaland, the likes of Kevin De Bruyne, the likes of Bernardo Silva, the likes of Gandouan. Uh, also, their keeper talking about Hedinson has been very, very, you know, uh, uh, very, very instrumental in the success that Pep Guardiola has been able to achieve at uh, this season. Also, when you look at uh, uh, the likes of uh, Lateral uh, Martinez has been very, very instrumental, you know, getting to ensure that uh, Inter Milan, you know, gets uh, to uh, the finance of uh, the uh, Champions 
Champions League. And also when you look at the likes of uh, Romeo Lukaku. And don't forget also uh, that goalkeeper Onana has been a very, very solid uh, goalkeeper in between the stick of uh, that for Inter Milan. So it's going to be a cracker. Uh, this uh, Champions League uh, final. We expect this pendulum to swing at any particular side. Manchester City uh, have not actually get to win the title. This will be the first time in history if they can go all the way uh, to win uh, the Champions League uh, title. And also Inter Milan, this will be their fourth time if they get uh, to beat uh, the citizen uh, come uh, tomorrow right there in a uh, talking. So, I'll leave it with this uh, the last question. Who will win at the Champions League title? Will it be Manchester City or will it be Inter Milan? Ensure you get to subscribe to my YouTube channel and also follow me on all my social media platforms. I'm talking about Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, all at Video Wale. Thank you for watching. God bless you. Bye-bye for now.